Hey Libra, welcome to Shared Sentience. Thank you all so much for being here. I really appreciate you. This is going to be a general reading for what's coming into your life and why, okay? So we're going to go ahead and jump right on into this here, Libra. Um, I'm going to pull eight cards and then I'm going to uh, clarify with the marbles, clarify each card with the marbles. So I'm just doing something a little bit differently. And um, Libra, I've been uploading a lot of readings lately and YouTube is a little bit limited with the amount of notifications that they send out per creator per day. So um, if you guys would like, you can head over to my channel after uh, you're finished here and um, check out your playlist. Just check out the videos. Make sure there's nothing that you missed um, and weren't notified for, okay? So I um, just wanted to make you guys aware of that. There could be some videos you haven't seen. So let's go ahead and look here. What's going on for Libra? What's coming into Libra's life and why? What's coming into Libra's life and why? Three of Swords. Goodness gracious, you guys. Okay, let's see what else we get. Four of Swords. Good, good. Okay, I like that. Now, I'm not connecting all these cards. Like, if these are different situations here. Um, however, with the Three of Swords showing up, or the Four of Swords showing up right after the Three of Swords, um, I do connect those two because um, they're, like, in sequence, okay? So, it's like there's, there's some healing here. Oh, my goodness. I love this bottom row, you guys. I love it, okay? Yes, this is unlike any of the ones I've done so far here with this um, because it's like there's a major turnaround at the end here and it starts off really rocky, okay? So, um, you start off with the Three of Swords, Saturn and Libra. So, I do think that there are some relationship obstacles coming your way here. Truthfully, Libra, I feel like you're already having these obstacles with a person, okay? Maybe two or three people. What's going on with this energy here? All right, um, you've got the orange. I feel like some of you, this could be surrounding somebody's um, like mental state, somebody's, um, how do I put this here? Like their, their view of the world. I think you wanted something long-term with an individual here and it's like that your views just don't align with one another. They just don't um, click anymore. I think maybe they clicked in the past, but um, you're ready to move on. You're ready for something new here. Uh, some of you are moving on from a Leo is how this feels to me, or you're moving on from a Sagittarius, all right? I'm also getting that some of you could be moving on from a Virgo, okay? Uh, maybe towards a water sign, all right? Maybe towards a water sign or another Libra, all right? Next, you have the Four of Swords coming into your life. Jupiter and Libra, so something to be grateful for here. What's going on with this energy? I also feel like that's major healing. Um, and I think that's why we had the orange marble show up as well, because again, that's like health and wellness. It's optimism. Um, you've got the white marble here with the green and the brown running through it. Some of you are taking some time to accept something and to heal something here. Um, you're taking a time out. You're taking a little break, uh, moving back to a place of stability, um, regaining some innocence here in a sense. So I don't know what's going on with that. Like you are moving into this space where you don't want something to rob you of your innocence. No, you don't want a person to rob an experience of its innocence. So that's a pretty interesting energy here. So I do feel that you guys could be healing from a heartbreak here in your life. They're not going to ruin, you know, the innocence of future relationships for me. It could be something like that here. But overall, I feel a healing energy moving in for you guys. All right. You've got the nine of pentacles, Venus and Virgo. I see you changing your looks here. All right. Um, I see you changing your looks or getting something new. What's going on with this? All right. Um, we've got this white marble here with some uh, yellow, some red, some blue running through it, even some brown. Okay, so give me a second to process this one. I think you're cleansing all around. Like there's this energy of just wanting to rid yourself of the old. Some of you are like getting rid of old things, okay? You could be throwing all your clothes out, getting a whole new wardrobe here. You could be doing something like totally different with your hair. It could be something like that here. You could be getting a new car. You know, there's something physical that you're wanting to change. You're just wanting the old to be gone. Um, and like, I feel like there is this birth of a new you here with this nine of pentacles. I also feel like there are some new responsibilities coming in. Um, I do get a fertile energy, so just be mindful of that if you guys are not um you know if that's not something that you're wanting um i do see a fertile energy here okay so i see some new responsibilities uh because of that and this could even be that you know um there's a fertile energy here with something that you're trying to build something that you're trying to work on and it's successful so it's obviously a new responsibility something to maintain right so it could be something like that as well then we have the world there's completion coming towards you okay there's also attention for some of you here libra for those of you uh, especially those of you who may work on social media um, with the world showing up that could be like the world wide web let's go ahead and look at what's going on with that Yeah, we've got, <clears throat> excuse me, you guys, 
We've got this blue marble here. Um, I feel like somebody is really admiring your transparency. So Libra, um, that could be the clue here for some of you. If you are looking for um, what's going to work, I feel like there's there's there are people here who admire your transparency. Like they want, they like it when you're emotional. I don't know what's going on with that here, but somebody wants to see you in your emotions. They want to see you raw and real. Even if this isn't like a group of people, this I feel like this could be like a person who's wanting you to show more emotion towards them, okay? They're wanting you to be more open, more genuine. Here, Libra is how that feels to me, okay? Um, they're wanting some kind of completion with you of a certain phase in your connection, in your relationship. This could be a fixed sign, Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio, or Libra. Leo. You got the Five of Pentacles showing up next, coming into your life here. Why is this coming into Libra's life? Oh. You got this like really uh, clear marble. It's got a little bit of blue running through it and a little bit of white running through it. I feel like there's somebody here who wants something from you. So I definitely feel that there's a person coming in. They also feel as if you guys are still in the same spaces. Like, you know, it almost seems like this person could have neglected you in the past here. Um... You know, like this can sometimes represent a stagnant energy. So I do feel like something kind of went cold. Um, this person, they could have, you know, ghosted you or something of that nature here. But I do feel like they're in a space where they think that you're, they're still going to find you where they left you kind of energy here. Like they still think that you guys are like both on the same level here. And I feel like you've grown. You've elevated so much. You found so much clarity that they failed to give you. And it's like, you know, I feel like this person is coming in trying to gain something from you, trying to get you to walk with them in their struggle. And it's like, oh, no, 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 I'm not struggling anymore. I'm Ten of Pentacles, right? That's the energy that I feel here. That's coming into your life uh, with that Ten of Pentacles. And I love these last three cards. This is the best reading yet, you guys. Uh, we've got the Ten of Pentacles, the Justice card, and the Ten of Cups, okay? you got the yellow with the red and blue running through it here to clarify the Ten of Pentacles. I feel like you feel an emotional attachment to something new that you're doing here, Libra, okay? You feel a passion for it. Uh, it's something that actually makes you want to get out of bed in the morning. So I like that for you guys. I feel like it's something that makes you really happy that's coming in here. And it's going to provide you with major stability financially, all right? Um, you've got the Justice card here as well. So I feel like clarity, honesty is coming in here for you, Libra. What's happening with that? Um, you've got the blue with some yellow and green running through it. I feel like a Virgo or a Scorpio, um, maybe a Taurus, is going to choose to be honest with you about something here finally, Libra. Um, I feel like they're wanting to connect with you on an emotional level. Um, they feel like you're a soulmate. I think you could have felt like they were a soulmate in the past here. Now you're unsure if they have any meaning in your life at all. I think that you've uh, kind of moved on from this, but I do feel like they're communicating something to you. They want to connect on a deeper level. I do feel like it's too late, but I feel like th this could be part of their lesson here. Um, you have have the Ten of Cups showing up as what, what else is coming towards you. So that's full-on happiness, fulfillment, okay? I love this for you guys. This is unlike any of the other ones. I mean, I got a few bad cards for the others, but like this one had like ending with these three really good cards. Oh my goodness, look at how clear. Look at how clear. Like full-on clarity, like full-on cleanse, you guys. Oh my goodness. And full on release. Like you got um, these open arms up here in the card. It's like the two figures. They've got their arms open. They're releasing things. I feel like you're coming into alignment with a twin flame, like a counterpart here. And the both of you are finally doing your healing. You're finally releasing everything that needs to be released here, Libra. And you're welcoming in the good. All right. There's just this really clear energy of like just a sense of belonging and I love that for you guys I absolutely love this reading um, so I really enjoyed this I hope that you guys will watch out for your other signs and check out your other videos but if this is where we part thank you all so much for watching and supporting me and you enjoy your um, the rest of your month bye